Welcome back to XCOM, and we are at a critical point because I stopped the game here just to show off something new that they added this expansion pack. I hope everything sounds well too, but here we go. What the hell? Sir! Internal systems are shutting down all over HQ! Looks like it What have you done? Answer me! Sir! We're picking up movement near the outer perimeter. Multiple sensors have been tripped. We have a breach! Rut row. Aliens again. Hostile forces have infiltrated XCOM headquarters and are moving in with reinforcements. We have to protect the base at all costs. If we don't hold the line here, any hope we had of stopping this invasion will be lost. So the idea is we have to defend the base. <laughs> Delta section. Looks like your emergency generators are back online. And oh, oh sh Delta, whatever this attack is, you're right in the crosshairs. We've got perimeter alerts triggering from all sides. It looks like you've got flyers coming through the cavern near the rear guard station. Plus, you've got a whole wall of heat signatures coming down through the vents in the ceiling above you. Whoever breached our internal security locked down the door system separating you from the rest of the base. Once we get the doors open again, we can start sending reinforcements through, but that might take some time. Right now, it looks like the closest alarms being triggered are in the vents above you. Keep an eye out for any indications of movement. Delta Section, you have to hold the line. The future of XCOM is counting on you. Before I start, let me just check on the recording, because I haven't done it in a bit, so I'll be right back. All systems are go. Now, he said they would be coming from above and from this area, so I figure putting my sniper somewhere where she's completely exposed is a good idea, huh? Um, up here actually might be nice because it's a elevation point, so... And she can jump. Yeah, look at those boots. Ooh, this mission, I think... Okay, because uh, they're going to be reinforcing. I guess we're going to have more than just six people, which is nice. What do we have to start with? We have two rookies. We have our assault, which is good because lots of damage quickly is necessary. And then we have our heavy, which eh, is okay, but heavy by itself. I mean, his rockets not that great. Not that I'm <laughs> regretting having Mr. Hidden along. Uh, I don't really like this spot because it looks like it's kind of exposed. So I'll slowly move Megan Mitchell over. Rut roll. Damn it. Good job, guys. You totally hit your targets. Oh, and a chrysalid. Oh, don't make that two chrysalids. Oh boy. Jesus, so they expect me to. How many aliens is this? Oh my god. Okay, thank you. They give me reinforcements at least. <laughs> I was gonna say. Oh god, but it's a bunch of rookies. Oh, uh, we have like... Okay, what's the best I can do? Um... So she can kill this and continue shooting, that's obvious. So, one easy kill. Okay. Let's, uh... We're gonna have to leave one of these guys alive, so I figure it's better to just get rid of the ones we can get rid of easily. 
I don't want to keep the mind controllers alive for sure because they do so much. So here's a 89% chance to hit. Please hit. Good job, Hidden. 89%. I'm gonna carve out the right side here for us, so uh I'm on it, Commander. Oh god, there's one above us too. The Muton does way more damage. The little guys can do mind control, which is pretty annoying, but if you had to choose between them dying they like mind control and uh Actually, what I should do is, since you're just a rookie, <laughs> you're less important to me in the overall scheme, so I'm sorry, but you're not going to shoot. Oh, well, that's great. I guess you could throw a grenade down here, actually. That would be a better idea. Well, let's destroy some of our base. It's okay. We can rebuild everything. That's good. The one nice thing about having a bunch of rookies is that they can just shoot grenades all over the place. Or not shoot, throw grenades, what am I saying? Heading there now. She is so gonna die. Like, there's absolutely no way she lives through this. But it's all good because, um, I just want her for her grenades. The idea is to kill the Muton before he gets to do too much, or before I have to use too many of my main soldiers. I'd rather just use my expendable rookies. <laughs> Which is a pretty mean thing to say, but well, what are you going to do about it? Now she could fire, or she could throw another grenade. We just need to get rid of these guys, so grenades for everyone! Because look, I killed the Muton. Oh, I don't kill the Muton, but I killed the, um... You know, the, uh... Mind-controlling dude. And I still have a couple of shots. Um... God, you're going to be useless. Whatever. Yeah, that's what I thought. Just throw a grenade. So we have to shoot that guy at all. I could have used my sniper, but I want to save our ammo because sniper rounds are not unlimited, but grenades and rookies seem to be... Well, this is nice. I could run and gun this guy and hope that I kill him. Ah, oh, should I do it? Hmm. What can my sniper attack? Oh, no. Well, you might as well try 70%. Ooh, ooh, that's good, that's good. So if I can kill this guy, the alien bug's gonna have absolutely no line of sight. Which means that I can... Hopefully, uh... Live through them the next turn, so... Double rapid shot, come on! Nice, second hit! Good job, bicep. Assaults are the best class ever. Okay. So, <laughs> I had to say it like that. Toasted. Yay! We did well. Maybe Megan Mitchell will live. You hear that? This alien is confused. Okay, that was his second turn, I think. So, no piercing for you. Yeah, no piercing for you either. This isn't so bad now. It's just that initial wave of aliens that makes it a little uh, awkward, I guess. He's exposed, so there's only one thing to do here. Oh, she can't see him yet? Wait. How can nobody see this guy? He's right there. Whatever. So the sniper still can't see him even though he's... Wait, where is she? No, she can't see him. I guess I'm just gonna move her here then. And now she can see it, but it doesn't even matter because. Thank you for actually hitting something. Where is my rookies? <laughs> Let's move them pro progressively uh, this way. Yeah, use your really crummy gun to almost kill him. Two damage! These guns suck so bad, but eh, they can still work. 85, I believe! Good job, rookie from Mexico. And now we just use our other soldiers to shoot so that hopefully the assault doesn't have to... Yes, see? The idea is that the assault doesn't stay too far exposed, because, I mean, she's good out here, don't get me wrong. I just 
I'd rather reload her gun so she can do rapid fire. Yeah. Send forth the aliens! Nope, no aliens still. I'll take a free reload round, thank you very much. Eh, I'll put you closer. Oh, I should have reloaded her gun. Already. Um, Overwatch with a pistol is probably better. Yeah, they come. Oh, oh cyber discs. Ground forces can reach that area. They may be limited to aerial units. Do I get reinforcements now? <laughs> it's the one thing I care about. A oh, little probe. Let's help you. That's a lot of cyber discs. Holy cow. I'm obviously not going to charge into there because. Oh my goodness. Just send all the mechs. Why don't you? Next, you're going to tell me the sectoid mech can just waltz right in. Obviously, I am going to get us in better positions first. Oh, it's dashing. I mean, this is okay. Ah, just stay down there, whatever. Stay. 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 Reload. She's kind of exposed, but... The idea behind having her here is that she can just waltz out and pop whatever comes through the doorway if it just stops there. The real question is if they're all going to just blast in at once, <laughs> all together. Everybody take your reaction shots. Oh, if she would have hit, that would have been awesome. Of course the heavy, which has a lower chance to hit, hits the thing and not her, but hey, 10 damage is a lot, I'm not even complaining. Yeah, you guys are kind of useless, but you are going to be meat shields, so we can all be happy about that. <laughs> Oh, I could have kept her in Overwatch with a shotgun too. Whatever. This one's probably gonna die. I don't see it doing too much. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh. oh. <laughs> the poor rookies. We still have Overwatch shots? Oh, Nibis. How on earth do you see that, but not the other one? That confounds me. Is that even the right word? I think it is. He's gonna take shots at hit and oh, the grenade. Okay, they killed the rookie. <laughs> they killed the rookie. I said that would die earlier. No, not, not much of a surprise there. Oh god, a third one. Jeez. Oh, here comes the next rookie. Yeah, I'm sorry you guys, but you were kind of... that was kind of expected. <laughs> so obviously I'm gonna shoot a rocket at these guys and hope that you can hit these things for the love of... <laughs> for the love of God, and there's one job you have. I can't even kill anything because it's only gonna do six damage at most. Never mind, I forgot he does more damage to mech. That makes things better then, never mind. <laughs> well, I'm kind of glad now. So I'm thinking she just goes up here and blasts one with a shotgun because there's no way these are both going to lift it this next turn. I, I'm not going to let it, so I'm just just go up. Do it with a one with more HP. Thank you very much. Goodbye. And finally, we're going to use the sniper, I think. Oh my god. <laughs> so many explosions. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, that wasn't so bad. We just lost two rookies. And one of them panicked because their friend died, so it's all good. Meat shields and the grand scheme of things. Not a big engage. deal. I'm on the move. Congratulations, Cars. You get the move up. Sensors don't show anything moving near the rear guard station. You've got that section under control. Commander, we've almost got the auxiliary power banks charged, and I should be able to get one of the interior blast doors open. I'll send as many reinforcements through as I can before the charge dissipates and the door locks down again. Please send in more than one person or else you're disappointing me pretty hard, Bradford. That's your name, right, Bradford? I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> Reload! Overwatch, Overwatch, Overwatch. 
Cover watch, and you get to hide again. Oh, I destroyed all your cover. Nah, it's okay. Sacrifices were made. You can stay right here and reload. Reloaded. We're picking up activity in the ventilation system near the mech bay, Commander. Weren't there's a, yeah, there's a still a little problet in here, so I don't understand why we're just ignoring the problet, but okay. I don't know if he killed that or not, but he took a reaction shot for some reason. Up any additional contacts near the command center. I think you've cleared that area out, Commander. Oh yeah, you seem to be nice. See ya. Orders, oh, it's still as alive. As the power banks spool up again, I'll send another group through. How can you see this? What is this? Oh, okay. I was gonna say, how do you see that? But you know, that makes more sense. Uh, you might as well try a second time. See if you can hit this thing. Oh, one damage, Nibis. One damage. Well, luckily I have Rookie Garcia here to do the job. Or Garza, excuse me. That's pretty low. Can you throw a grenade? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna destroy some cover here, but whatever. Guaranteed kill is a guaranteed kill, right? Unless she throws the grenade incorrectly, but I don't think I don't think grenade throwing incorrectly has ever happened. And she even got a promotion, so high fives all around. I could put you here. Oh god, if I put it here and I trigger a billion aliens, that would suck. So instead, heading there now. Oh, a sectoid. Oh my god, sectoid is such a big deal. Please kill this. 82% chance. Thank you. Nice. I'm just gonna progressively move over in this direction. There's still a little probe guy in here though, like, and the sneaking thing, right? And I don't think we ever killed it. Um. Okay, I know this is kind of weird, but I'm just moving in here because I want to kill that probe. Because if I don't kill it now and it stays alive, oh, it's not even there. I'm just overwatch with the shotgun. Yeah, if it's still there later on then it, and I can't complete the mission because it didn't die, that would be pretty dumb. But for some reason, I'm not holding that as a thing that possibly couldn't happen. It seems like an I, it could happen, so... Who still doesn't move? Mm, I see. Uh, I think you should kill this guy. You have a pretty good chance. I'm rolling. Let's see if she triggers anything by going here. Contact. Uh oh, another one. Yeah, it's not. Um. Uh, no, no, no. Hold on. <laughs> can anyone else even get close? I don't think so. I mean, you can get up here. The sniper can get really far, but it's just two moves. So I'm gonna move the sniper here, and then. Yeah. And then the one only person not here with us now is the uh, assault. So she's just kind of chill there. And I feel like I should kill the one that's closer because it's, I don't know. It's closer. <laughs> that's my logic. Better to kill because it's closer. Wow, oh, well, four damage. Okay. I don't know if he can attack this guy from here. Well, I'm gonna find out. Nope. I don't really want to use her to shoot. Ideally, I would use this support to shoot that so that she can keep her ammo full. And it's possible. Kill confirmed. Kill confirmed. And now we just move forth all the rookies. Well, there's only two of them left, right? So, <laughs> never mind. We move forth all two of the rookies. To soak up the damage and also... Well, pretty much to soak up the damage. It's an unfortunate circumstance, but bodies are needed. Needs to reload. Um, I feel like you'd be better off... Well. I could keep him on Overwatch here, I guess. It's not like he can see too much. And you need to move because holy cow, you're so far away. Uh, yeah, I should have done it there. Stupid little probe distracted me. Yeah, just move all the way. I'm not worried about her at all. Okay, what's he gonna send at me next, XCOM? Nothing? That's nice. That means I can move people forward more. Since we saw sectoids, I'm just going to take a wild guess and say that the next enemies are probably going to be more sectoids. 
Seems ideal. Or not ideal. Seems uh, reasonable, that's the word. So you have a pretty good vantage point here. Uh, I could heal her, but she only took f 4 damage, and I, I highly doubt they're going to send enemies right on top of her, and if they do, I'm going to be laughing at my words, but eh, I think it's safe to just keep her with her wounds. How far can you go? Mm, not far enough, apparently. Moving to designated I'm on it. On my way. Not sure. <laughs> we'll move you forward a little more. You get to venture into the breach. On Overwatch. Still nothing? Wow. Well, they really want me to get good positions, then. I'm totally okay with that, so, yeah. Hidden the Russian. Russian hidden. Actually, we'll keep two people on this side, so... Mr. Clean... Mm, Mr. Clean can... I want to keep him on high elevation, because... Or, at least the normal elevation, because in case they jump on these platforms or back here, then... At the very least, they will be close. I need more DPS on the left side, so when I see it can go here, here. Uh, I mean, she has a pretty good vantage point up there, so I'll just leave her in a moment. Oh, I can put you down here, that's what I should have done. There we go. Mr. Rookie, you can go here. Okay, so there. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven or eight people. I don't know. Oh my God! <laughs> one sec. God, okay, I muted my mic there and I continued recording, but sorry about that phone call, it just happened. Um, I'm going to use my rookies now to be sacrificed as meat shields for these sectoids. I actually mistakenly used my C instead of my sniper to kill this guy over here, so that was a bit of an error, but what am I going to do about it? Uh, I could do this. This is safer than... Yep, we call that safe. So... So, ah, uh, no. I want to ideally kill her, or use, um, at least kill this, and then the other one will have a pretty close shot. Oh, hello. Look at that, obviously. A whole two damage. Nice. 75% chance, I believe. Oh, uh, I was a fool to believe. Shot failed to connect. Oh my god, you don't have to yell it. It missed, I know. <laughs> Obvious statements are obvious. Eh, whatever. Oh, nice. So the way this is panning out is... Oh, for the love of God, I'm throwing a grenade. Just because I don't want you to miss. <laughs> it's kind of dumb to just use a grenade for one sectoid, but... Eh, you never know. This day and age. Not this day and age, but this... Uh, okay, so she's going to kill this guy. Easy. Goodbye, robot. And then the next one, she cannot kill. 
So she's just gonna disable him so he can't shoot his guns. Yay! He's Good dead. job. Pacifying target. You pacified that target. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good statement there. Well, I didn't even think. Good job, uh, 2K game, whatever it's called. Yeah, you can't do anything, buddy. I know. Oh, God. I didn't see that happening. I forgot I threw a grenade here. Sacrifices were made. That's all I'm gonna. I'm gonna justify with sacrifices were made. Okay, go ahead and move forward. Very nice. Ah, oh, can I kill you now with a sniper rifle? Hmm. It's looking like a no because if I don't crit, then it doesn't hit. So, yeah, this is. Bit oh, I should have rapid fired. God. I don't know. I guess I'm gonna do reload on the same turn then. Actually, no, I wanted to do this because she needs to reload and she gets a free shot after this because he's exposed. So, reload! Beautiful. And all it cost us was friendly collateral damage. It's not too bad. Not too bad. She earned a promotion and then she died horribly. Sounds like a fitting end to me if I ever heard of one. Yeah, let's move up a little. Reload complete. So do I not get any more reinforcements? Is this what I'm stuck with? It's a little annoying, but yeah, that's okay. Um, I'm not gonna open this door yet, and that seems like a terrible idea. Um, I will reload you though, and I'm gonna move everybody up. Mm, sure. Everyone gets their own personal rookie to uh, follow them bravely into combat. Do you even? Oh, there's no good spot for him to move. I want to move him somewhere where he can just be concealed the whole time, but it's not looking like I get that, so... Ooh, this is a little tricky. I don't want to move right in front of that. I mean, I should, though. I could open doors on both sides, or I could just go one way. I don't know why I would split my troops up. I should just go one way. Like, what am I thinking? Uh, sure. And then the other support gets to go right here. Got it, moving. Oh, that leaves the awkwardness of you. I don't... I mean, they could come from here, but for some reason I'm not feeling like they would. Because it's too obvious, right? <laughs> I'm going to be biting those words. But I'm going to move her up. Commander, we're picking up contacts moving through the forward access tunnel ventilation system. So I'm biting those words pretty hard, but they don't appear to be all outside, so it's okay. Oh god, he was outside though. Well, that's what I get for moving too fast. And worst of all, she can't even see anything. I mean, do I move her back at this point? It's seeming like I should. Yeah, whatever. On the plus side, everyone's reloaded, so it's not all too bad, but it's still pretty bad. We can see an alien from here, too. What alien can we see? Oh, you're just a bundle of joy, aren't you? Ah, oh, this is such a terrible engagement spot. I'm just gonna move everyone back in Overwatch. Well, actually, no, you get to throw smoke, but... Yeah, we're gonna just let them have... I have a couple of rookies, I think. <laughs> uh, this is what they signed up for, so it's not like I'm being too cruel with them, but... Oh god, where I, I even put you? I could put you here. Oh, why'd you open the door? What reason? Ah, that's right, because if you click the mouse button for some reason it decides you're going to open that object instead of, you know, ignoring it. So I'm going to throw one smoke down here. So hopefully she doesn't die. I guess she's still kind of close. I could have moved her away a bit more, but it's all good. And then you, my friend, are just going to stand here. You, my friend. <laughs> I'm calling you my friends now because I'm going to be using you as sacrifices later, but... Alright. So for the best. 
think I heard something. Me too. It's probably those guys we just saw in plain sight. Hello. Commander. He doesn't get a shot. Nice. Up now. Once they reach a full charge, the doors will open and I'll send another group of reinforcements through. How very generous of you, Bradford. Thank you. Thank you for your consideration. Yeah, nobody has a good shot on this guy, so I'm just gonna use an attack here to get hollow targeting. Oh, what do you know? Well, that seems like a waste of ammo. Who is cheap gun? You have a cheap gun, right? Sure. Good job. What was your name? Oh, uh, no. Garza. Good job, Garza. Uh, I kind of want to put him down here. Just because I can. Like, there's no other reason to. Or here. But he probably should stay close for the uh, healing. 